Once you have completed your drawing from Fusion, we're going to open it in Adobe Illustrator. Click File, Open, and find the PDF that you exported. From here, you can see that your line drawings or vectors have been imported properly. We need to change the document color mode, so make sure to select RGB color. You can select all of your parts by highlighting over them. Hold Shift and click the top two color boxes. The outlines or the stroke need to be red. The stroke weight has to be 0 0.001. The boxes on the outside of the glasses are from the export in Fusion. So we're going to just release that clipping mask by going to Object, Release Clipping Mask. We can then select our boxes and delete them. Select all your items and group them together or press Ctrl G. That way they can be manipulated together now. From here we're ready to laser cut. We can hit print and make sure that the VLS 3.5 is selected. Click print. In the bottom right screen, there should be an up arrow and we need to hit the universal control panel. We'll power on the laser in the top right and it should be initializing. This sets all the zeros. Once the printer has fully initialized, you should see idle in the left hand corner. At this point I've placed my material in the laser cutter. I need to change the settings. I will choose natural wood and medium wood. We're using three millimeter birch plywood. So you can change the units and make sure it says three millimeters. Hit apply and okay. And that should set the distance. We will also move our glasses to a corner of the wood as to save material. Now I can use the focus tool to select points around my object. This will allow me to see where I'm going to cut on the physical material. If I need to, I can move my part from here. Once you like the placement of your parts, you can move the laser out of the way, make sure everything looks good and ready to cut. We'll hit play and watch our cut. I've made sure that I've turned the exhaust on. You can also see a preview of our cuts. Once the laser is done, it should go back to the origin position. We can turn off the exhaust after a second, open up the machine, and take out our parts carefully.